When I was six years old, I fell into the Arno. I soon found myself drifting down and into darkness. Certain my life was at an end. Instead, I woke to the sound of my mother weeping. At her side stood a stranger, soaking and smiling at me. My mother explained that he had saved me. And so began a long and prosperous relationship between two families. Yours and mine. I am sorry I could not save your father and brothers. You have nothing to apologize for. I believe Jacobo de Pazzi played a part in their deaths. The attack on you as well. I need to find him. That coward fled before we could arrest him. Have you any leads? No. They've hidden themselves well. They? Jacopo was not the only conspirator to escape. If they work with Jacopo, they were surely involved in the plot against my family as well. Give me their names. Antonio Maffei. Archbishop Francesco Salviati. Stefano da Bagnone. And Bernardo Baroncelli. Bene. I will go and see my uncle. He has men stationed in the countryside. Wait. Before you go. A codex page. I took it from the files of Francesco de Pazzi, seeing as he clearly no longer needs it. I've always had an interest in things of antiquity, as did your father. It is meaningful to me as well. Then consider it a gift. Che il Signore ci protegga. You're all right. This madness with the Medici and the Pazzi, is this why you pursued Francesco? Not exactly. Well, whatever your reasons, the city is safe again thanks to you. Now tell me, how may I be of service? Ah, another page. Aha, it's a similar cipher to the last one. This won't take long. Interesting. Hmm. Indeed. I see. It's another blade design for delivering poison. Can you build it? See, it won't take very long. I just need to find a way to hollow out the blade without sacrificing it. It's all right, Leonardo. Just do what you need to do. All done. I filled your blade with a bit of poison to start with. Should you run out, just visit a doctor. Poison? From a doctor? In high enough doses, that which cures can kill. I am in your debt once more, my friend. Anytime, Ezio. Anytime. I have traditional remedies and the wisdom of... <laughs> you look... sent from Firenze by Il Magnifico to attend to some unfinished business. I'm looking for Jacopo de Pazzi. Ha! Who isn't? We've been at it for days. And perhaps what I carry will help us both. A list of his co-conspirators. One of them will talk before he dies. Excellent. These men are sure to lack Jacopo's resources, which means they will be easier to find. I will put my scouts to it at once. I appreciate the help, Uncle. Got something else for you as well. More codex pages. Ah, let's see what we can learn. What is this? What profit? 
What did you find, Uncle? Just another damn mystery. The text here roughly translates to only the Prophet may open it. There's reference to two pieces of Eden, but these pages offer no answers, Nipote. At least, not on their own. You must find more. We'll have to save it for another day, Uncle. I have a mission to attend to. As you wish. Now, if you hope to defeat these bastardi, I will need to teach you a few things. Meet me on the practice field. All right, Ezio. You're familiar with counterattacking, but what happens when your enemy is as well? I don't usually give them the opportunity. Tough talk offers little protection against Templar steel. Then by all means, Maestro, teach me what to do. Now dodge! Uh, hurry up and die! I'm getting thirsty! Bene, bene! Now do it again! Much better! One last time now! Bravo! Let's see it another time! One more time, Ezio. Feel your Detroit. Enjoy the ride down to hell. <laughs> Magnifico. Once again, you exceed my expectations. Signore, we found the Arcopus men. And they wait your word to strike. Relay the following. No man moves until they have spoken with Ezio. Intesi. It will be done. Go, Ezio. Visit with my mercenaries in the countryside. See if Jacopo's lackeys won't lead you to him. But be careful. They will be expecting you. There you are. Listen, we've found Stefano da Bagnone. Just follow this road and it'll bring you to the abbey where he's taken refuge. Wait, before you go, take these. You can use them to create a distraction. My thanks, friend. right where is Jacopo nothing to fear I suppose they meet in the shadow of the Roman gods ora se libero dalla paura requiescat in pace
We found Archbishop Salviati. He's barricaded himself inside that villa. Take some of my men. Use them to clear the fields. Then find a way over the wall so you can open the gates. Ah. Command over my own army. A nice change of pace from the usual sneaking and stabbing. I like it. Ben. A lavoro. Jug of good Chianti to bring a certain man your head. A fair price, no? Finish, please. No match for us. This trash is dealt with. Not you. Get it. I warned you to stay away, assassin. You should have listened. Men, prepare yourselves. The assassin has arrived. We need to find a way to open the gates. You Templars, always singing the same song. Do you think a few mercenaries will scare me? Ah! They should. Shall I send your remains to that Ubriacone, Mario? <laughs> What's the point? There won't be anything left of you to recognize. It's quite a plan you have. Spouting nonsense while you send these other men to die. I am a mystical man. What say you to this? Turn back now, and I'll call off my men. Sorry, friend. You are on my list. Your fate is sealed. Tear his limbs from him! Let us paint the walls with his blood! There is no way to treat a guest. What is this? Guards! To me! Where is Jacopo? He knows you come for him. Emerging only in darkness to meet with the others. That answers when. Now tell me where. La fede dovrebbe dare conforto. Non pena. 
Requiescat in pace. Ezio, about time you got here. We found Bernardo Baroncelli. Ottima notizia. Tell me where he is and I'll see that he's dealt with. That's the trap. Lorenzo actually had him arrested days ago, after being returned to us from Constantinople. But he escaped. We believe him to be somewhere inside San Gimignano. Va bene. I'll see if I can't pin him down. How do you expect to succeed where the rest of us have failed? I have my ways. things one day at a time. He'll get bored, uh, lost, confused, distracted, killed. It will be okay. And if he does come, if it happens, hey. I keep moving. Never in one place for long. Only, only how to sleep, when to sleep, where to sleep. The guard tower, perhaps. They're thinking mad. They don't know. I'll pay them, yes. He's here! Help! Assassin! So you can do to him what you've done to me? There is still time for you to clear your conscience. We gather at the church when a meeting is called. Mi duole dover giungere a tanto. Requiescat in pace. Salute, Ezio. Antonio Maffei has sought refuge atop the city's tallest structure, spouting scripture and arrows in equal measure. The man has clearly lost his mind. Making matters worse, he's posted archers all around him. You'd do well to clear them out before approaching. Grazie for the information. Do 
my word. You must repent. Repent and seek forgiveness. For your wicked ways have incurred the wrath of a demon. Summoned by your sin, he now walks our world, cloaked in shadow and darkness. And everywhere he treads, death follows. Why, you ask? Because you have strayed and sacrificed your liberty to that wretch, Lorenzo de' Medici. You are puppet, enslaved by first strings. Won over by poisonous words. You have lost your virtue. You have lost your dignity. You have lost your faith. And this draws the demons in to feed. And feed they will. All whilst you wander, lost in ignorance. Know that good men have died protecting you from his evil. Men who sought to save these lands. To purify them! Join me in prayer, my children, so that together we might stand against this darkness. Give ear, O heaven, and I will speak. And hear, O earth, the words of my mouth. Let my teaching drop as the rain, my speech distill as the dew, as raindrops on the tender heart, and as showers on the grass. For I proclaim the name of the Lord! Away with you, demon! Have some respect for death, my friend. I'll show you respect. No, I will. E tu possa al fine trovare riposo, nel corpo e nella mente, da cui esca in pace. Stay my blade long enough to follow him. He'll lead me to his Templar brothers. I'll have more names for my least. <coughs> nice moves. I, I sing a different song. Mm. <laughs> What's going on here? Are they late? I've seen as much as I know. Ciao, then. Come back and see us any time. Oh dear. You wouldn't know anyone. My like lace is a good guy. Come. Come. What are you and the others planning, Jacopo?
I need my friend! One by one! Damn you, Steve! Go get your sister! Go we get together, yes, huh? Don't. But don't you forget us. <laughs> Professional oh, soldiers, eh? I've known milkmaids would have had you soiling your face. Steve, only potente, but she Bene. Your letter mentioned Venezia. Are there Templars there as well? Whatever I did to deserve this punishment, I'm sorry! Many men are responsible for my father's death. I'm sorry, Maestro. I did all I could, but the assassin proved too strong. Clearly. Else the others would be here with you. To say nothing of the fact that Firenze remains in Medici hands. It's Francesco's fault. His impatience made him reckless. I... I tried to be the voice of reason. More like the voice of cowardice. You're one to talk, Signor Barbarigo. Had you sent us quality weapons instead of this garbage you Venetians call armament. We put our faith in your family and you repay us with inaction and incompetence? Then when asked to account for your failures, you make excuses and insult us? How do you expect me to respond? I don't know. It's all right. I do. Uh, uh, no. Please. No, don't. <laughs> Please don't what? Uh, 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 I can't. Fix this. <coughs> oh, me. Spare me. <laughs> no. <coughs> what a mess. So sorry to have claimed your prize, assassin. 
Did you honestly think I wouldn't expect you to follow? That I didn't plan for it? We've been at this a lot longer than you. Kill him. I know you're only doing as you're told. So if you release me, I will spare your lives. Ah! Listen to this! Ah! Oh! Oh, your friend. <laughs> Damn! On him! Vai amico, libero da fardelli e paure, requiesca di pace. The Pazzi are dead. Every one of them. I must admit, I've never before believed I could desire the death of others so badly. Nor I. Ezio, thank you for the role you've played in keeping this dream of mine alive a little longer. L'onore è mio, signore. What will you do now, figliolo? There are still others I must hunt, signore. They are already digging their claws into the heart of Venezia. No. La bella Venezia. Then that is where your journey must take you, Ezio. Before you leave us, I have something for you. A gift. This cape identifies you as a friend of the Medici. As long as you wear it, the city guards will be more tolerant of your actions. But be warned, it will not grant you immunity from the law. Che la fortuna favorisca la tua lama.